Taking Marissa's seminar on troubadour poetry really helped me to connect with the troubadour arts ensemble and also to understand the poetry as a whole. I'd only studied it briefly from a musical standpoint and so was very excited when I was able to take a class that focused specifically on troubadour poetry and the themes there. And Concurrently, while I was taking the class, I was writing a grant proposal to go to France and to study troubadour performance practice, which I received. I spent a month in Paris at the Bibliothèque Nationale studying the manuscripts and transcribing the music melodies when they were present and the lyrics from each manuscript. I focused on the Comtesse de Diaz a Chanta Mer, which I was interested in because she is the only Choberitz, or female troubadour, whose songs have survived with a melody. And I also focused on several Giro Riquet songs because when I was done with my month in Paris, I traveled to the south of France, the Languedoc region, and spent a month performing and studying with Gerard Succhetto, the leader of the Troubadour Arts Ensemble, and his wife Sandra, the soprano who sings in the group. We performed several concerts, one in a town called Casino Jou, and another in a 10th century abandoned church in a town called Cabrerol. Some of the recordings that we made from those concerts will be featured on the fifth CD of a CD set called La Troba that Gerard and the Troubadour Arts Ensemble have been working on. Their goal is to provide a complete recording set of every Troubadour song that has a melody. And so some of my performances will be featured on the fifth CD, which is devoted exclusively to Giro Riquier. And I feel that I grew tremendously as a performer and as a student. <laughs> 